hello wordpress nerds so in this video we are going to talk about how to set custom login page in our next js app and also we will see how to redirect user after login without being reload to the page and also we will display some messages using toast message so let me show you that by the end of the video you will be able to do this so if i if i write a uh, wrong credential then you will see the toast message like this logging you in and then you will see the login failed message and if you add correct credential then it will display a success message and then we will be redirected to the home page without being reload so let's begin the code before jumping into the code i would suggest you watch this playlist from the beginning so that you know what we are doing otherwise uh, you won't be able to understand what we are doing in this video this video is dependent on this video next auth credential provider so yeah i would suggest to watch this video so let's begin so previously when we try to log in and if we add correct credential then after successful it is reloading the page then it redirect us to home page but we don't want to reload the page as this is our next js app so we will try not to reload the page so uh, how do we do that we have to prevent the redirection while login so for that first of all let me let me open our pages login.js and here on submit we wrote this function sign in function from where it is signing in user so first of all let's assign a variable and uh, you can see that we are passing some data uh, in the sign in function so here we have to pass some parameter something to prevent uh, reload so i'm gonna go to next auth js documentation client api and i will go over here in the sign in so in the sign in they provided what sign in function accepts so i will scroll a bit down and here you will see that we can pass redirect false so that it prevent the redirection so i will go ahead and pass the redirect false in this object and that will be passed to the sign in function and now i will console.log this and now i will log out i will inspect the element So I will zoom a bit okay now I will try to log in I will add correct first so as you can see it did not redirect to the home page with reloading but it stopped the execution here we get okay true that means our our uh, 
login is successful so we can use this status now so now once we get if login dot ok then we want user to redirect on the home page which is this this URL we get over here so how do we redirect user without being reload so for that we can use reacts route component so sorry about that so we can use the user router component of reacts i will search this on the google first i will go to this first result so here you can see how can we use that route so first we have to import the user router from the next router so i will go inside our login.js and i will use this user router and then i will take a constant of route router equal to use router okay and now we can use so if we are successfully logged in then router push router dot push so this is the function we can use to redirect without reload and we get the URL inside login dot URL and how we get that URL over here so we pass that over here as a callback so um, now let's go ahead and again let's add the credentials and login so as you can see now page is not reloaded and it redirected us on the login page oh, sorry home page after login now i'm going to log out and now let's try to add a wrong credentials and if i click nothing happens so at this moment we have to display some message that something is wrong so for that we will be using the toast messages so for that i'm gonna use a hot toast react package so hot toast so react hot toast rht so here i will go ahead first uh, i will go to the documentation and i will first install this package so i will i will stop the server and i will install this package so let's wait for the package it is now installed so once you install this is the basic usage first we have to import the toast message so i will import that in the login.js then we can use this toast whenever we want to use so for example if login is not successful so i will add this inside else and i will say login failed and there is one more thing we need to add so we have to add this self closing toaster tag anywhere on the page so i will add this below the submit button and that's it so now if i 
start the server and pm run dev let's wait for the server and uh, i will go to login page i will refresh this and if i add a wrong credentials now i'm getting that login fail so um, as this is an error message i'm gonna go here in the api toast and here you will see that how you can display some success message toast message error message so as this is error so i will use i'm gonna get rid of this i will use toast dot error and let's see what happens so if i log in so it is displaying some cross mark here so that we know that uh, it is an error so now if i if you can see that when we log in it stays some it takes some time to log in so during that time we can display some message using that toast that you are logging in and once the login is successful we can just show them that successfully logged in and redirect so let's do that so here as soon as we click on submit uh, then we will display that you are currently being logged in so logging you in so first I will go here I will I will display the loading message so I will use test toast loading and I will say logging you in <coughs> and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna set some time so that it won't display all the time so for that yeah we can pass this object so second parameter is object so i will pass duration one second so this is in millisecond so this message will display for a second uh, let's keep 1500 millisecond so now if i click on So it will display logging you in and if login is failed we will have login failed but what if we are logged in successfully so at that time I'm gonna display success message as well so if I go here toast dot success and I will display I will add this once we are logged in so successfully logged in redirecting okay now again if I go and I will add correct credential and login so as you can see it is displaying successfully logged in and redirecting and it redirected us on the home page so this is how we can we can prevent our login page uh, uh, reloading after login and also we can display error messages or success messages using toast so if i log out again so yeah i mean this is what i wanted to show you in this video
So if you have any doubt or question, please write down within the comment section. I will provide all the related links into the description section. And if you like this video, please write down in the comment section from where you are watching this video. Thank you.